So I'm just gonna do a reflection of my exam. I took it in about 45 minutes. Um, it was 135 questions, but I made the decision not to go back because, well, one, it was kind of difficult to navigate back, how to go back to each page. But what I did on my scratch piece of paper, because it was computer-based, I just listed the number of the questions. And literally, I just didn't know the answer. So I gave it my best guess, and then I submitted my test. Um, I did take a silly survey at the end, and I told them that they need to improve their design of the test, make it more like, you know, the modern school-based, computer-based testing. So like have the numbers to where like, if you flag the question, you can go back and review it before you submit it. Um, yeah, there was a lot that I didn't know. I counted just about 27 questions that I knew I had leeway for to get the 80%, but there's always a possibility that I got those right. So I feel pretty confident that I passed. I don't think I passed with 100%, but that's fine. As long as I pass, I can go on to the next part and do my verbal exam or oral exam. So it is 510. I'm gonna go visit a friend in Orlando. 24 hours to get my test results. And if I passed, I'm gonna sign up for the oral exam and just study, study, study for that so that I can have this certification under my belt and, and work freelance.